everybody, welcome back to Healthy Foodie Girl. Or if it's your first time here, welcome. I'm Shauna, Healthy Foodie Girl. And I'm Ella, Healthy Foodie Girl Mini. I love this creamy crab dip recipe because it's super easy to make and it can be served hot or cold. You know we love options and we have them for you in this video. And you can use phyllo dough cups to make these perfect little appetizers. Let's get into this video, but first make sure to subscribe down below if you haven't already and hit the dinger so you get notifications when our next video comes out because we don't want you to miss a thing. Now let's get into this video. These are all of the ingredients you're going to need to make this delicious crab dip. First, we're going to start by prepping some ingredients. Cut about one quarter of the bell pepper so that we can chop it. Finally chop it and then chop it into tiny pieces until you have one fourth of a cup of chopped bell pepper. You want the pieces to be finely chopped so they disperse evenly throughout the dip and then you can go back and chop it even more so that the pieces look like this. Next, grab a lemon, wash and dry it, and then you're going to zest it. We just used a few zests of lemon in this recipe and squeezed some lemon juice until we had half a teaspoon of lemon juice. Now that everything is prepped, we're going to start combining the ingredients. Take four wedges of Laughing Cow cheese and add them to a bowl. We love using this cheese because it's creamy and it's low in calories, but you could substitute it for some cream cheese, and if you want to do that, check out our website to see how. Then add 1 4th of a cup of zero fat plain Greek yogurt and you're going to combine both of those ingredients. Then take the lemon zest and lemon juice from before and add those to the bowl, followed by 1 4th teaspoon of garlic powder and 1 half of a teaspoon of Worcestershire sauce. Then you're going to take 1 8th of a teaspoon of cracked pepper and 1 8th of a teaspoon of salt and add both of those to the bowl. Once you've done that, take one half of a tablespoon of fresh chives or one half of a teaspoon of dried chives and one tablespoon of fresh parsley or one teaspoon of dried parsley. The next ingredient is one fourth of a teaspoon of Old Bay seasoning, which looks just like this. Add that to the bowl and then take one fourth of a teaspoon of stone ground mustard. Make sure to thoroughly combine all of the ingredients and you can add an optional dash of hot sauce. Now take one six ounce can of lump crab meat and thoroughly drain it to remove any shells and excess liquid before adding it to the bowl. Then add the one fourth cup of finely chopped red bell peppers to the bowl. Thoroughly combine those ingredients and you will have the most delicious crab dip. You can enjoy it cold like this with some bread or crackers and it's super delicious. Also, we sprinkled some fresh parsley on top. We sliced some bread and toasted it in the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 to 12 minutes and then put some crab dip on top and it was super delicious. Also, you can enjoy this crab dip hot and it makes the perfect mini appetizers. We added a scoop of the crab dip to phyllo dough cups and baked them at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for 10 to 12 minutes. We know you'll love this crab dip whether you enjoy it cold or hot. Also, make sure to check out our sweet and savory Brie Bites and our apple butter. You can find all of the recipes from the videos on our channel and at HealthyFoodieGirl.com. We really hope you enjoyed this week's video, and if you did, give us a thumbs up. And make sure to check out our website, HealthyFoodieGirl.com, where you can print the recipe. Absolutely. As well as while you're there, sign up for our email list, because we deliver those healthy recipes straight to your inbox every week, and we don't want you to miss a thing.